The tangent function can be made one to one by restricting it to the interval negative pi over two to pi over two. Thus the inverse tangent function is defined as the inverse of the function f of x, which is equal to the tangent of x, where x is in between negative pi over two and pi over two as figure eight here. It is denoted by tangent inverse or arctangent. Again, we have a restriction on y, but notice that we can't let y be either of the two endpoints in the restriction above since tangent isn't even defined at those two points. Also in this case, there are no restrictions on x because the tangent can take on all possible values. So the tangent inverse of x is equal to y implies the tangent of y is equal to x and y is in between negative pi over two and pi over two, but not inclusive.